how to find the missing Samsung Galaxy S4 with the remote controls feature on the device before you can um, use this feature you first need to uh, activate and set it up on your phone so to set it up first let's go back to the home screen by pressing on the home key then tap on the menu key at the bottom and choose settings in settings tap on the more tab at the top from here go on to security once you are in the security page tap on the uh, under the find my mobile section tap on the remote controls from here you need to put in your Samsung account password this is the password when you initially set up your phone uh, when you create the Samsung account now if you can't remember uh, the password for the account you can just tap on find email addresses or password link here and it will take you to a page where it, will, where it can assist you to retrieve your lost password now I'm going to put in my password here So once you print the password, you can tap on the show password checkbox to see um, if you have uh, correctly put in the right password. Once you put in the password, tap on the confirm button. So now it's got the uh, introduction to remote control so you can read it to learn how to use it. And tap on the OK button. So if you don't want it to show, so you can tap on the do not show for 90 days so it won't show again. Now from here, make sure that the remote control is enabled by sliding the switch to the right. Then um, there's a location consent, so you can tap on that. If it's not already checked, you can just tap on that to make sure that you agree um, to the terms and service. So basically, that's all you have to do to uh, enable the remote controls. Once it is enabled, you can then go to find my mobile web page. So um, I'm going to tap on this link here, but basically. Uh, it will take me to a Samsung Dive website. So let me just try to uh, turn it around so you can see the full URL. So it'll be uh, from my mobile.samsung.com. So if you go to your PC or computer, you can just simply type in find my mobile.samsung.com. Previously, it was um, uh, samsungdive.com. So uh, they have changed it recently to a new URL. Now you can, uh, once you're on this page here on the computer, simply just tap on track and control the mobile. So I'm just trying to find out. Okay, so you need to sign in here at the bottom. So let's try to sign into the site. So I'm just going to turn it around. Whoops. I'm going to pin the password. Then just simply uh, tap on the sign button. So I'm signing into the page. So um, this is my first time that I like uh, signing with this account. So I'm just going to uh, accept the term of service and tap on the agree button at the bottom here. So now once you are on this page here, you see there are several options that you can do. You can locate the mobile, you can lock your phone, you can uh, ring the phone so that um, uh, the person who got your phone can hear it. So hopefully if they hear it, they can uh, uh, give you the, the phone back to you. You can call and forward uh, messaging. You can forward the message. You can also check the call logs. Uh, you can wipe the mobile and it will be fully erased in case you have some uh, personal or private data that you don't want other people to see and finally the last option is you can unlock the screen so uh, from here you can uh, go into settings by tapping on the edit button at the top so you can also change the phone number if you wanted to now to uh, locate the, the missing phone just tap on locate my mobile and you should see it's trying to locate the phone so say tap on the locate my mobile at the bottom and now just wait for it trying to locate the phone so that's all you have to do to try to locate your missing phone on the Samsung Galaxy S4 thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more video tutorials